Within the pro version of Brizzy, you can get a lot of great looking layouts ready to use. But also many of our partners provide layouts that you can get as demo sites or starter sites or layouts. It depends on what the partner likes to use. We're looking at this wedding planner pre-made layout for you that comes with the Astra Agency bundle in their premium starter sites. And before we go into it, if you want to know more about that, you can go and check out the Astra website. You can have a gander and you will see some of the Marcus Agency. These are pro versions. That means it comes with the paid pro version of Astra. But I'll show you a little bit more at the end about this and how you can install it, as well as a very nice feature that comes with an Astra if you want to use it for the pro layouts. Right, so let's have a look at this wedding planner layout. And if you ever have a client or you yourself is a wedding planner, then this is what you probably would like to use. It's a great starter site and that's why Astra refers to it as starter sites. We've got the homepage about us, services, gallery, venues, and then the contact us. The most important part for me of any landing page is this first Euro image or whatever you want to put at the top. It has to tell you exactly what this is all about. You see planners here at the top, then you see wedding planners and event organizers. You don't have to guess what's going on here. This is all about wedding planners. Very visual and I like the layout and display of the site. You have the wedding planners a little bit more and this will take you to About Us. Few services here and then you have a very nice parallax scroll effect here with some social icons. Scrolling down the wedding destinations that will take you to the venues page and then you have another big Euro banner here for the services book my wedding dates. One testimonial over here from Joey and Phoebe. I guess that's Phoebe. And then under that, a gallery with some of the images. And then at the bottom, we get here to this contact area form. And now I will draw your attention up here to our top bar where it says edit page, which you are familiar with, edit page with Brizzy, which you are familiar with, and then edit footer with Brizzy. So keep in mind something else is going on here and that's a nice way of how Astra can work great with Brizzy, bringing in the Astra components and then Brizzy within that. And I'll show you that in a short well. You also have here in the footer bar at the bottom, some copyright by Brizzy Astra, and then you have your menu again. So let's click on About Us to have a quick look at how the About Us page displays. Another great Euro banner over here with a little bit of information and then some counters about the events nailed. Nailed is an interesting word to be used with wedding. And then exclusive destinations, honeymoon places and place it is mood. Okay, not sure what that means, but very nicely done here with these counters and the icons. And then you have the team over here, meet our planners. Again, good looking team of people with their social media there and then we get again to this area which you can guess by now is the footer services what do the wedding planners give us in terms of services a nice matte finish header up here again and then serving the base with start planning button then the services photography catering cocktails and bridal makeup and then again just a call to action here want your wedding to be perfect and memorable and we get again to our contact footer area here at the bottom. A nice other feature that comes with Astra is the scroll to top. You can see it here and you can style it within the pro version to the same color of your site theme. Click on it all the way to the top and then gallery layout for the photos. Give you a good overview of all the photos. Some nice videos that you add here. Guys crying over their last day and then you have your footer again here and then before we get to the contact venues venues i've never heard of and venues i'll never be able to afford skydefernix i guess asterix and oblix got married over there and then a number of more venues here and a no more button here Again, it can take you to a contact form or it can be a downloadable PDF that will include all the venues that people can choose from. And here we see again our footer at the bottom with a contact form. This is very standard nowadays. If you're offering a service and you need to ensure that people can easily reach out to you, you have to have that contact form at the bottom 
of every page. And then on the Contact Us page, this will not appear. There you will have, well, your standard form, like over here. And then under that, you will have maybe your extra additional information, like email, your phone, your physical address, and a map. And again, the reason for putting this at the top is that when people click on a contact page, they usually want to send you a message. So it's most likely that they want to use your contact form. That's why you put it at the top. You will have your social icons here. Of course, not all four of them, Facebook. And then if people physically want to come and see you after they failed wedding and they want their money back, then they're going to go for the address and of course, phone and email with your location where you can be found. And there's really nothing more you can have in a wedding planner website. So this premium layout from Astra really covers all your wickets and you don't have to worry about anything. You can use this, just change the photos, maybe change the font, and of course, change the context and the contact details. Now let's go have a look quickly at where you can get this. And you will see on this last page, it only says edit page with Brizzy. It does not say edit footer with Brizzy because we don't have that footer element here. But let's go have a look. We go back to home and then I will click on the edit footer with Brizzy so you can see what is going to happen when I click on that. It gives me this footer area. If you own Brizzy Pro, you will think, where did they make this? How did this footer creep in here? Was that done with a template? And the answer is yes, but no. Not a template within Brizzy, but a template within the Astra theme. And that is under custom layouts. If you look here under appearance, you will see custom layouts. If I just click here on the Astra options, which is pro modules, you will see over here, it says custom layouts, and then you have to activate it within your Astra theme. And after you have activated it, if you go to custom layouts, you will have the option to basically create templates. And this one then is the footer that Astra had created. They set up all the settings here, display on the entire website and do not display on contact us. So that's how they set up their conditions. After that, they published it and then they said to edit it with Brizzy. And that's as easy as that. So you can actually create the templates with an Astra and then within those templates, you can edit it with Brizzy. Isn't that great? The last part is just quickly to have a look at where do you get these premium sites from. I showed you at the beginning, you have to get the agency bundle from Astra. And then after you get that, you're going to install it within your plugins folder. Here you will see the Astra premium sites. You get free Astra sites as well. And you can search the WordPress repository for that just called Astra starter sites or Astra sites. But if you want to go for, well, the premium sites and the pro sites, you have to go and get the agency bundle and then you will get the Astra premium sites. After you have activated it, if you go to appearance, you will see Astra starter sites appear here. And then it will give you the option to select your page builder. In our case, it is Brizzy. And under this, you will find all these very Astra sites, the free ones, as well as the premium pro ones, or as they call it, agency. And quite a number of them ready to use. All you need to do is change the content. Over here, you can see this is the one that we had used. Just quickly, how are you going to install it? When you click on it, you will get all these options on the left. It will ask you to install the required plugins, customizer settings, import the content and import widgets. And all you need to do is click here on import site and it will do everything for you. You can just sit back, relax. Well, it may take a little bit longer depending on the amount of content. So go make yourself a cup of coffee, come back and then just make the changes where you need it.